Hello fellow gamers and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Green Hell Spirits of Amazonia Part 3. Ooh, almost didn't get it out that time, huh? That was a close one. Alright, let's see here. Let's get the day started. We'll eat some of this Ooh. raw meat. Oh my gosh, three parasites. Yikes. I didn't see that one coming. Really didn't. I don't think I've ever eaten raw fish before, but now I see why you're not supposed to. <laughs> wow. I learned something today. All right, and we'll bring these over here. There's just too much stuff over there. We'll pick up some carbs along the way. Um, so what we did in the last episode, we went ahead and finished the legend. Well, we didn't finish the legend. It's we completed all of the uh, little little messages on the stones, uh, and we have the legend. We just need to prepare the bait, which we shall do, hopefully along the way. But I'd like to go up here in this area, uh, find some of the um, legends over here. It looks like I've already found a couple, and there's a couple that are missing on here. So that's what I'd hope to do today. And hopefully along the way, again, we'll find the centipede to complete the bait. But yeah, let's get her started. I maybe complete a totem along the way as well. I've had my eye on that one totem for a minute. Do we need any rocks? We don't have any rocks on us. Okay, we're taking a rock. And let's continue, shall we? Getting pretty close with this game on uh, getting all this stuff taken care of, I think. So we are 2625. Right there. Okay, so it looks like we got those taken care of. But is there. We got this one, didn't we? Yeah, we sure did. Okay. Well, let's see here. There's another one over here. Is it over here? Doesn't appear to be over here. So if we're at 2625. Let's do this. Let's go this way. Get on up there. Come on. I remember where it is now. I remember. Okay. Yeah, let's head over here. Now, in this area, do I remember where it is? No, no, but it's pretty straightforward. Yeah, it's pretty straightforward. There we go. The second will defeat enemies with its sharp black claws. The Guardians. Yeah, here we go. All right. Keep it moving. Good night. I know I complain about the, the quote-unquote new jump mechanic. I guess I should call it the newest jump mechanic. Just makes Jake just flop all over the place. <laughs> eh, well, 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 one of these days we'll, uh, we'll figure out how to best it, you know? Oh, and I'm sorry, I should show you. It's right there, 25-25. Okie dokie. So, one thing that I meant to do in the last episode was go into this little cave over here, because I did mention that I want to create another Aztec weapon, but I do need two pieces... Give me that. I need two pieces of obsidian. Two obsidian stones. So, I, I want to... Ah! Don't get bit by the spider. Where are you? I see him. There we go. And you know what? We need carbs. We need water. This has both. Alright, so yeah, if you head up along this way and just kind of hug this wall over here to the left, you'll see a cave. There you are. And not every time, but a lot of times there is an obsidian stone in here. And there's one in here now, so we just need one more and we'll be good to go. And we'll just continue on. We came from up there. We're going to go down over here. Let's see here. It's like a little puddle. 
over here that we need to check out. And it should be... There it is right there. There it is. And we are at 2423. Their powers will be locked in clay. All right. Next. <gasps> powers will be locked in clay. Okay, sounds like... Uh, Something important. Okay, I think... What are we, right here? Yeah, we're right there. Oh, and... Uh, Alright. I missed something. Can't... Eh, let's just take a <gasps> shortcut. Let's just take the service entrance, right? And this'll be one of the last ones in this area. And then we have to go to the airfield. What am I doing? And we need to go to the airfield. Okay. I mean, it was looking at me right in the face. You know, I was just so... It's a story about the monkey guardians. I want monkeys. But, uh... <laughs> it, it was staring me right in the face. I was just so worried about the... Um, Obsidian. Let's see what we need over here. Yes. Okay, we need bones. We need feathers. We need rope. Okay. And a tapir skull. You don't have the room, but you hit the Y button, and now you magically have room. That's an ant bed. Alright, a lot of times a tapir. Let's see if we can go find the one over here, actually. Got some rope along the way. Gonna need one more. Alright, let's not scare the little fella. Okay, we'll find him. We'll find him. I always speak in a lower voice when I'm on the hunt. There's no reason to. They can't hear us. They can't hear us, gamer. Alright, we'll find him. Just listening for the pitter patter of little feet. Oh! Did he glitch? He glitched. All right. He went down there. We'll, we'll let him run out of steam, and then we'll we'll pick him off. There you go. He's come back. Ah! Uh, oh my gosh! No! 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 no. The mouse slipped! I got him in the rear end. That's not good. Got him in the rear end. Got him in the rear end. Alright, where you going, buddy? Where you going, fella? He's got fight in him. Got him. Got him. Ah, how's that for a little cliffhanger? And how convenient. We are not far at all. From the totem. I'll take that. Okay. We don't need any of this meat right now. There we go. Perfect. Did we get the skull? We did not get the skull. Why not? Uh. How about now? How about now? Yes! I'll pick those bones up in a minute. Are you kidding me? <laughs> how, do, how do we... We always have 30 feathers on us. How is this possible? Well, I hear a lot of feathers flying around. That's for sure. Let's see if we can't... There we go. Got him. There we go. Excellent. And there's my arrow. I was wondering where the arrow was. Let's rinse off before we eat something on accident. And then we're going to complete this totem. Boy, I thought... Uh, this should be enough. This should be enough feathers. What do we get? Like six, I think, from them, if I remember correctly. So we should be in good shape. And we'll take a little snack. Disgusting. Ugh. <clears throat> 
Okie dokie. There you are. Love it. Oh, I heard some thunder. All right, so where were we? We got the totem taken care of. We might as well, one of the things that I forgot to do in the episode before last is go through the uh, entrance over to the, um, the, the other entrance over to the airfield, which is what we're gonna do after we get the final legend stone in this area. It's not the final one, but it's the final one in this area. Time to hear my favorite music. Can I? Let's see here. Yeah, these are gone. They're practically gone. Let's destroy that. We don't need it. Uh, what? They love congregating up there with the painkillers. And we'll just eat one to top our... Oh, our energy's pretty much topped off. Okay. We'll skip the music for now. Let's go this way. Oh, okay, maybe not. <laughs> we'll get a little music. Get a little glimpse of the music. So, over here, we already have this one. And there's one more... Where? Here we go. Just follow the water's edge. And again, there's one of the little blue orbs. We're going to get to those in a different episode. I want to try to knock them all out in one episode. I think that would be a lot of fun. Might have to do some editing because they are in different parts of the world. Alright, here's our little, our little spot. We're at 2620. Not over here. We can we can check that box off. Not over here. Wait, is it down below? Can't remember. Ah, that's a stone. We don't need that right now. Nasty, nasty. I see, there it is. Yep, yep, it is down below. Uh, that's a bad idea. That's a very bad idea. This we're just gonna make work. There we go. Here we go. They will be brought to life by the kindness of a visitor's heart. Wonder who they could be talking about there. Wait, we only have one left? We only have one left. Okay. So let's do this. Let's get our leeches off first. Oh, there we go. And let's keep it moving. Alright, let's see if we can't find... There it is. Not hard to find at all. Let's head on up. I want to make sure. I feel like I'm missing something. Maybe not. Okay, alright. 
Nice. Is this the one? The first will be on the lookout for danger. Yes. With a gaze hard as a nutshell. <laughs> Craft and bring monkey statues to the village. Monkey statues. Monkey statues. Okay. Okay. Monkey statues. Oh, monkey statues. Monkey statues. Hmm. Monkey statues. All right. Looks like we, uh... We're gonna be building one of these bad boys, huh? Maybe there's a little change of plans right now. I was gonna go to the airfield, but, uh... Let's make some monkey statues. <laughs> Let's at least get the pottery started. This is going to be a bit of an undertaking as well. Because it requires some stuff. What is our trust at? 585, man. See, this is one of the reasons why I, w I was going to mess around with the totems over in that other area, but I was like, I wonder if we can get our trust high enough without having to do that, you know? There we go. Ah, dirty water. Dodged a tiny bullet. Well, maybe like a BB. Bullet's probably kind of strong. <laughs> All right, so let's head back, I guess, to our little staging area. We should have enough room over there, I'm thinking. Hopefully, maybe, probably. Oh my gosh, we only have four arrows. I totally forgot about that. How many bird feathers do we have? We have three, so we can make, make it five. Make it an even five. Yikes. Alright, no problem. Maybe what we do... Should we just make it over here? Is that what we should do? Should we just make just a nice little structure in this puddle? Ooh, hello. I think that's what we're gonna do. And we got nine feathers, so that's great. We can make four more. Alright, let's do that. Let's go into building mode. I know some of y'all prob have probably missed that. I know I have. But hey, we're going to get back into it before you even know it. Before you even know it. Just want to get this story mode taken care of. And, uh, oh, I want to say this too. Um, you know, if you like watching building episodes, definitely check out the Twitch live stream. I'd really appreciate that. We're still doing other stuff right now, not going to lie. Uh, but we're, we're going to finish that. I think we're going to finish it quicker over there than I will over here. Personally. Just because, you know, I'm crushing it over there. Just going to say it. I mean, when you got four hours to work with, you know. But yeah, if you're interested, come check me out on Twitch. Let's do the old multi-crafting thing. But if not, yeah, I'm still going to do... Ah, ah. <sighs> okay. Get in there. We got too much stuff. 97%. I'll take that. Yeah, that's fine. We, we should be fine with that. We'll definitely be fine. We, 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 we've done better with less, am I right? Yeah, we've done better with less. Forty-seven. Let's dump these bones. There we go. Now we're gonna be able to chop some stuff down and bring it with us without having to worry about being overweight. Once you're under forty-five pounds, watch. You saw how Jake was struggling. Now when he picks these up, because these take these logs take. Uh, five pounds basically they put five pounds of weight on you so if you keep it under 45 you don't got to worry about it mm, I was gonna say I, I should have kept a closer eye on that go some rope 
And we just need one more, and I see it right there. Okay, perfect. A roof to keep water off the fire. That log threw me off for a second. I was like, what the devil is under this palm tree? Jungle plays tricks on your senses. I know it plays tricks on mine. Said it a hundred times, I'll say it more. Because it's true every time, you know? <laughs> well, we were just talking about that in the other episode where everything looks like either a caiman or a freshwater stingray over in the area that we just came from. Uh, ba 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 ba. Oh, there's another one. Cool. Yeah, we're gonna have to build. There we go. We're gonna have to build our own little, little staging area over here as well. And I'm not gonna build it on the airfield. You may guess, be able to guess why. You can't get mud over there. So it's not a good plan. Okay, and we should have some sticks over here. Yes because we chopped down a couple of trees over here. They also bring down little sticks with them. Well, sticks, but not a lot of small sticks, it looks like. Okay. Eight. Here we go. Here's some. I think we need one more small stick. There we go. We'll make it work. Yep, so we got one too many sticks, so we'll turn those into two small sticks. There we go, and we got ourselves a fire, we got our places to save, and now we can work on our mud, because we are going to need mud. I wonder if there's enough room to make, there should be, I want to say we did something like that over here. Um, another question... Do we have... First off, do we have another... Nope, we don't. Okay, do we have a vein in here? An iron vein. That would make life a little bit easier. Well, if we do, one hasn't spawned right now. I'm sure Keith will be able to tell me in the comments. If one is over here, if not, we can always make a run, so to speak. But yeah, with that... I should have charcoal on me. I do. Got campfire ash. So we should be good. Let's get rid of these guys. Where are you at? There you are. There you are. Um, I kind of want to put the mud thing up here. Nice. Eight. That'll be nine. That'll be fine for now. Okay, uh, oh, you know what? We'll put this chicken over here. So it'll lower our weight. And it won't spoil when you put it on there as long as you don't take it off again. You know, after it is supposed to expire. I... Shh, I guess we'll just put it here. I guess, you know. What am I gonna do? Okay, maybe not. I could have sworn we had it here. Okay, maybe not. Well, we're having it here. Okay. And it is the rainy season, but it is the tail end of the rainy season. That's one important thing to take note of. Um, which basically means we're going to run out of rain eventually. But hopefully we can get this project started more quickly than that. Oh, and if you're enjoying this, please don't forget to hit that like button. I hope if you've gotten this far, you are enjoying it. Okay, let's see. What do we what do we what do we have next? Uh, we're gonna need some more logs. Here we go. Looks like we're gonna have plenty of sticks for a charcoal furnace, if you know what I mean. Maybe some holders. To keep keep feeding it. 
Because, uh... The Forge is a hungry, hungry beast. Most definitely... Oh, let's let him rest for a second. There we go. Probably two more wax. Yep, and we're golden. And I think we just need one more set of these, right? Yeah, and we're going to have plenty of long sticks. More than we know what to do with. More than, more than we're comfortable with. <laughs> I'll just keep them kind of in a pile over here. Yep, here comes the rain. We should be happy with what we're getting. Nice. And this should complete our mud mixer. And for those that are kind of new to the game, I know some folks that are new to the game are watching this series just because they're interested in the DLC, the Spirits of Amazonia Part 3 stuff. Um, the way that you want to do mud is first you build the mixer. You make a batch of mud, like what I'm doing right now, or mud bricks, technically. And don't worry, I'll get those leeches. I just want to set this up while it's raining. So you put your campfire ash in there. If you don't have campfire ash, you just right click and harvest the charcoal. But now let's take those leeches off while the rain, as you can see, it's filling it up. It's also getting me clean. And it's probably giving the leeches something to drink other than my blood. Look at that. There we go. And it should almost be done. No, it is completely done. Okay, and the next thing we want to do is put down... This is the second thing you want to build. Oh, it's under fire. That's right. Mud charcoal furnace. Okay. Uh, we might have to take something down. Ugh. Why are you mocking me? Why are you mocking me? Alright, I saw you looking at me weird. <laughs> and hopefully in the next episode, that cave will produce another... Ah, it's getting dark. That cave will produce another obsidian stone and we'll be able to make our Aztec weapon. That's what I'm hoping. Okay, now that we've gotten that cleared out, we'll mix this up. We'll set this up, and you always want to have one extra mud brick along the way because you're going to need a mud brick to seal this up. You load this up with sticks, light it up, and you'll get a bunch of charcoal and a couple of campfire ashes as well. And we're going to have to pick that up in the next episode, I think. Folks, if you enjoyed this episode, please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It would mean a lot to me. But with that out of the way, I'd like to wish you happy building, safe building, and many blessings. Take care, folks.